Today we're going to be making a splash by showing you how to make these awesome slot dog sliders. So now let me show you how to make them. Today we're going to be making some epic slot dog sliders. If you want to go to a pool party or just have fun in the backyard, these are going to be an awesome summer treat. Welcome back to another Pit Boss Backyard Bosses. My name's Andrew, better known as the Grill Sergeant. You may remember me from such films as Fast and the Flavorous and Indiana Jones and The Last Brisket. We are going to be making something so quick and easy today on the Pit Boss battery powered tabletop pellet smoker. And what's cool about this is you could be chilling by the pool and grilling at the exact same time. With a 15 hour battery, you can smoke as long as you want. But enough flapping my gums, let's get in to the ingredients. We're going to be using some King's Hawaiian rolls, and then we're going to be using some bun-sized beef hot dogs. I found this little thing called the Slot Dog Slicer, and this actually makes these really, really cool grooves into the hot dog, and it's gonna be good for presentation, but I also like that when using it, we can then get some barbecue rub inside the hot dog. It's gonna be good. I have the Pit Boss, this is their competition barbecue rub, little garlic, paprika, onion, super, super good. All right. Let's fire up the pit. We're going to turn this thing to smoke. That's going to actually get it starting to warm up. And then inside here, we have our hopper and you can store about seven pounds worth of hardwood pellets in there. And so we are rocking with mesquite. It's going to be a quick cook right now. And so once this thing starts smoking, we'll close the lid, turn up the temp. Let's start slicing up these hot dogs. So we're going to open this up. So how this slot dog thing works, it's pretty much you have your hot dog right here. You take your slot dog press. We're just going to press down and then we can lift up on this hot dog. And then the cool thing is you get these really cool uh, cuts in there. Do that again. Right, pull this out. Very good. And I'll finish doing this and we'll tune back in when we season them up. Now I can hear the fire in the firebox. So I'm going to close the lid down and we're going to turn the temp up to 350. All right. So we got our hot dogs all cut up. Very, very beautiful. Let me just start just dusting these all over. And then I can kind of just roll them in a little bit. And once these actually grill up, is they're going to look really, really cool. They kind of flare out a little bit. So they might not look much now, but they're going to look beautiful once we're done. Tabletop pellet smoker is up to temp. So now let's get these dogs on the grill. All right. Close this up. Let them do their thing. So while the hot dogs are on the grill, probably going to take maybe about five or ten minutes for those to cook. And so in the meantime, we're going to take our King's Hawaiian roll. Basically you want to take a long knife. Why do I feel like a ninja when I do that? But we're going to come in here and you're going to start slicing down, but not all the way. You're going to stop pretty much till you get about halfway. And all you're doing is just making, you're basically just turning these into mini hot dog buns. There we go. So if you are going to an actual pool party, you can actually just slice them up and then put them back in the bag and then just bring the hot dogs and people can kind of make them their own, however you want to do it. It's just simple though. Let's keep it simple, all right? All right, it's been about five minutes. Let's check on these hot dogs. So I really like how they actually start spreading out. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to flip these over just so we can get a little color on the other side. I love those little grill marks on there, they're beautiful. All right. We'll check back in about two minutes. That was Morse code for let's get these hot dogs off the grill. All right, these wings are ready to pull. So I'm just gonna plate them up. Oh, look how beautiful that looks. Now that I'm done using the smoker, I'm gonna turn the dial. And then this is now in the shutoff mode. Just don't do anything to it. Let it shut off on its own. So now we're waiting for the smoker to turn off. Let's slice up these hot dogs. So you kind of figure out maybe right around here, and then right around here, that's not too bad, not too shabby. Look at that, wow. You know you're a grill expert when you can make cuts like that and it's beautifully even. So, all right, let's get this wiener into this bun. So we're gonna put this just like so, 
And there we go. You don't even have to take these out. You can pretty much just come in here and start filling them in. So it's almost like you have your tray right in here. 24 sliders. This took like 10 minutes, super, super easy. So now let me get the toppings and then we'll do a taste test. So now I'm gonna make some fixins for the hot dog. So let's start off by slicing up this onion. Gotta love the power of editing. <laughs> All right, let's doll one of these up. So I'm gonna start here. We've got our mustard. A little bit of ketchup on here. Whoop. Sprinkle some onions on top and then boom, there we go. Look how beautiful that looks. Bon appetit. Wow. Well guys, that was it. Quick, easy, fun. Make sure to subscribe to this Pit Boss YouTube channel to make sure you stay on top of all these awesome backyard bosses cooks. We're all starting out. Bye.